If you want to be confident whether you're doing easy single track trails or hard enduro, you have to master the basic techniques. There's a couple common problems that I see when people are trying to improve. And the first one is thinking that they've learned all of the basic techniques and mastered them. But let's say you're still struggling to get up steep hills because you're lacking traction, the rear tire is spinning. Well, it might be because you haven't mastered your throttle and clutch control. So the rear tire is breaking loose and you're losing your momentum and stalling halfway up, which is not only frustrating, but it can be scary when you stop and you start sliding back down the hill. Or if you're struggling on flat corners where your front tire is washing out, forcing you to slow down. Well, when that happens to me, I know that I'm not in the right body position, which is a basic technique. So if you haven't mastered all of the basics, then you're going to be struggling in certain areas, which will force you to either slow down or you're just not going to have the confidence because you don't feel like you can get up that hill or over that log or around that corner as fast as uh, the other guys that you're riding with or gals. Or maybe you've learned the proper techniques. You have the knowledge, whether it's from watching a YouTube video or going to a riding school, and you can do them when in a controlled area. But then when you get back on the trails, riding with your buddies, you're trying to pick up the pace, you just revert back to your old techniques or old habits, which aren't the proper ones. So what is the solution then? Well, I found that after I discovered all of the proper techniques and then I formed positive riding habits so it's muscle memory I don't even have to think about what I'm doing to use the proper technique that's when you'll see huge results and how do you improve in a matter of weeks and not years well when you learn all of the proper techniques whether it's from watching videos on YouTube or investing in a coach that will show you all of them when you're intentional and practice like your balance and clutch and throttle control at slow speeds. You can quickly build up your muscle memory, which will translate to more confidence on the trails. And if you have tried that and you're struggling, well, there's a good chance that you're still a little bit off in your technique. And it can be hard to tell if you're just trying to go out and practice what you're learning on a video or from a coach, because what you feel you're doing might not actually be what the proper technique is. And if you have a proper coach, they can point out the technique, uh, whether you're doing it right or if it needs to be adjusted. And you can see big improvements very quickly that way, which is why I started the Virtual Dirt Bikers School uh, for casual trail riders that want to improve their confidence faster when it's just taken too long uh, trying to figure it out on their own. And you can see and feel a difference in a matter of just a couple weeks. You're not going to be expert level speed, but it starts with building your confidence. You might not be super comfortable at first because you're learning new things, but the comfort and speed will come as a byproduct if you want it to. And if you want to start learning these basic techniques now, you should grab my free guide. It's a PDF that you can download. Uh, you can get that at motocrosshideout.com slash basic. I made it because I want to share what I've learned through my mistakes and trail riding over the years so that I can help other trail riders like you. I'm Kelly Fager from MX Hideout. Ride safe, have fun.